Good evening, everybody, and welcome to this evening's weather update. So many areas across the Rockies and Central Plains are going to be seeing their first snowfall of the season tonight and tomorrow. And looking at the 18Z run of the NAMNES model, uh, we're already seeing snow across portions of Colorado, southeastern Wyoming, central northern Nebraska, into South Dakota and Iowa as of this evening. And as we go through the overnight, uh, snow is going to continue to push across much of Colorado into Nebraska, northwest Kansas, southeastern Wyoming, over areas like Denver. I'm going to be seeing heavy snow through the overnight hours and into tomorrow morning. Snow is going to continue across most of Colorado, pushing into southeastern Nebraska, northwestern Kansas. And there's also going to be uh, ice across central southwest Kansas into northwest Oklahoma, the Texas Panhandle, and northeastern New Mexico as we head into tomorrow morning. And this is going to continue into the early afternoon before we slowly see the uh, snow and ice push out of the central plains into Sunday evening. So looking at some snowfall accumulations, first the NAMNES model. The NAMNES model is putting widespread six inches to two feet of snow in the Rocky Mountains of Colorado, down towards far northern New Mexico, and in areas like Denver, we could pick up a good six inches of snow with this uh, snowstorm into eastern Colorado, as well a good three to six inches. Across Nebraska, uh, snow tolls are going to be a lot lighter, between about one to two inches, and maybe a dusting across northwestern Kansas into northwestern Iowa. Looking at the HRRR model for snowfall accumulations, uh, pretty much uh, the same as the NAMNES indicating good model agreement in snowfall accumulations of about six inches to a foot and a half in the mountains of Colorado and in the eastern plains of northeastern Colorado, including Denver, good three to six inches of snow across Nebraska, about one to three inches. And the only exception is the HRRR model is bringing more snow to Kansas with about one to three inches across central and northwestern Kansas in the HRRR model. Now we're going to be seeing some minor ice accumulations as well with our first winter, winter storm uh, across northeastern New Mexico, the Texas Panhandle, the Oklahoma Panhandle, and southwestern Kansas. We can expect anywhere from a glaze to about a tenth of an inch of ice accumulation with our winter storm in the NAMNES model and looking at the HRRR model, HRRR model is also bringing a glaze to about a tenth of an inch in areas like Amarillo through northeast New Mexico, southwestern Kansas, Oklahoma Panhandle, southeastern Colorado. So if you uh, plan on traveling tomorrow across these areas, uh, make sure you are really paying attention to slick spots in the road if you're traveling tomorrow. So thanks for watching this evening's update on our winter storm across the Central Plains. Uh, make sure you're preparing for uh, heavy snow across eastern Colorado, especially around the Denver metro, metro area, and ice across portions of New Mexico, Texas, Oklahoma, Kansas, and I would advise against traveling if you live in these areas tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Please stay safe and have a wonderful evening, my friends.